Hello and welcome to IP Innovative Training and Support Program. Here we are again with Editor's Training and Support. So in this module, we are going to discuss about overview of editorship. Editorship in publishing industry play a crucial role in refining the quality and originality of the published content. Editors are in charge of a number of tasks related to publishing, such as collecting manuscript, editing and reviewing the manuscript material, and guaranteeing the overall quality and coherence of final manuscript. In general, editors act as a link between writers and readers, making sure that manuscript go through an editing and polishing process before it is published. Their knowledge and meticulous play a major role in the success and quality of the finished work. As you can see in the picture here also, we have mentioned quality, originality, teamwork and knowledge are the major aspects of an editor. Now, very common questions arises in our mind, who is an editor? So in simple terms, we can say that a person who edits and refines text is called editor or an editor is a person who is responsible for publication of quality content. In publishing industry, the main responsibility of an editor is to edit, modify and enrich written content in order to increase its overall quality, coherence, accuracy and clarity. Editor's vision. The vision of an editor is a broader objective and viewpoint for the work they are producing or the content they are in charge of. It includes their core ideas, guiding principles, and the intended impact of their editorial work. Although each editor may have different perspective, but editorial direction, excellence, and quality, readers' understanding, ethical considerations, impact, and relevancy of the content are major things an editor should focus. Uh, editor's mission. The mission of editors in publishing is to ensure the quality, accuracy, and overall coherence of written content before it reaches its intended audience. Editors play a very crucial role in publishing process, whether in traditional print media or digital platforms. Their primary goal is to enhance the content to make it more compelling, informative, and engaging for readers. Now, we are going to discuss editor's aim in this particular video. The exact goal or purposes that an editor pursues through their editorial job are referred to as their editorial aim. It stands for intended objectives or outcomes that editors hope to achieve in their work. The major aim of an editor should be accuracy again and fast checking of papers, meeting deadlines, quality enhancement, continuous improvement and consistency workflow, etc. These objectives demonstrate the editor's dedication to provide readers with timely, accurate, and high-quality content. Now, there are various editorial positions involved within a publishing process, uh, like section editor, managing editor who manages the editorial staff, and editors who concentrate on particular subjects or concerns. Here are some of the examples we have listed in depth. So, the very first one is editor-in-chief. Top editorial positions within a publishing company or organization uh, is editor-in-chief. He is the person whose ultimate responsibility is to make sure the quality of the content, overall direction of publication falling under this jurisdiction. The major responsibilities include strategic planning, content selection, quality check, current industry trends, and challenges. They give editorial leadership, strategic direction, and expertise to produce engaging and effective material that appeal to the publication readers. Now, associate editor. The associate editor supports the editor-in-chief and their respective roles and responsibilities comply with the same term and conditions. They are responsible for managing and curating content for their designated areas while working under the directions and guidance of editor-in-chief. The next type of editor which we are going to discuss is section editor. A publication section editors are in charge of managing particular sections or departments, including content curation, editorial planning, writing management. They are experts in the field of specific assigned areas and showcase their knowledge within this field. They make certain uh, that the content complies within the publication standards, appeal the readership, and enhance publication overall performance and quality. The next is technical editor. The technical editor is the person who sees technical content of papers. Their primarily work is to check the technical things in the paper, including scientific papers, research reports, technical manuals, 
engineering documents, software documentation, and other publications that are technical or specialized. They employ their knowledge to enhance technical documents for the target audience by ensuring correctness, coherence, and quality again. They have a solid grasp of technical topics and terminologies. Now, we have other type of advisory board that is national adv advisory boards. National advisory board is a group of people who offer direction, counsel, and expertise to a national or local publication. This advisory board often consists of reputable experts who share their knowledge and suggestions to help the organization choose its editorial strategy. The next one is International Editor Advisory Board. It is a group of international people from different countries who recommends the benefits and give directions knowledge from diverse nations. Respected experts make up this advisory board and they share their knowledge and suggestions to aid the organization worldwide with its editorial strategy and direction. The major kind of editors in a publishing industry are managing editors. Managing editors play a crucial role in managing the editor team and supervising editorial activities. Their responsibilities include managing the workflow, making sure that deadlines are met, and preserving the publication general caliber and consistency. Other roles include quality control, editorial policies and guidelines, revenue management or budgeting, collaboration with other departments, or in short, overall management or workflow of the journey. The last but not least are the copy editors. Copy editors focus on the technical parameters of the manuscript, such as grammar, spelling, punctuation, and style, arrangement of text, table, and figures. They guarantee linguistic consistency, follows the publisher's journal style, and fix any potential mistakes or inconsistencies in the content. Along with this, they are uh, responsible for factual correctness also. Copy editors also took for any ambiguous or unclear information and can ask the authors about any unclear information. Now, we have guest editors also in a publishing uh, company. Guest editors are involved by publishers or editorial team to temporarily take the work for scientific issues or theme. Guest editors are typically chosen based on their expertise, knowledge, and credibility within a specific domain. Guest editors take a decision on new submission related to journal as guest editorial articles. Thank you for being a part of this editor's training and support. For more details, please visit www.ipinnovative.com guideline slash editor and www.mprp.in. Thank you so much. Stay tuned for our upcoming videos.